Welcome back to Vlaflik. Today we're going to make three different versions of Irish coffee. First, simple version without any bar tools or special glassware. Second will be more advanced version and completely creative version, a twist on Irish coffee. Okay, first, grab from kitchen coffee or teacup and let's preheat it with hot water. I'm gonna fill this cup all the way to the top. Keep water for like 20 seconds or so and then get rid of it. Depends how sweet you like your coffee, put one or two cubes of sugar. And for this version, we're gonna use regular homebrewed black coffee. I wanted to mention that it's important to use the coffee maker, but not the espresso machine. Because if you use espresso, the drink will be too strong. Don't fill it up all the way to the top because we need some room for whipped cream. Oops, just a little bit more. <laughs> there you go. Stir it a few times with a tablespoon. Our first whiskey choice will be Tullamore Dew, just because it's the most popular whiskey that used in the Irish coffee. And this whiskey also exclusively used at the Buena Vista bar in San Francisco, where Irish coffee was first served in the United States. Using shot glass as a measuring cup, and we need one ounce. We're going to use whipped cream topping, so shake it a little bit, then spray it on top of the drink. And that's the most simple way how to make basic Irish coffee at home. Okay, for our pro version, we're going to use proper Irish coffee mug. And we're also going to preheat it first with hot water. Now, let's use simple syrup, and since it's a bigger glass, we will use 3 quarters of an ounce. For pro version, our whiskey choice will be proper 12. Irish whiskey. And not because it's slowly becoming more popular than Jameson or because it's Conor McGregor's brand. We use it because it's really smooth whiskey and it also has vanilla, honey and apple flavor. This Irish coffee mug is a little bit bigger than our previous cup, so we need slightly more whiskey and let's use one ounce and a half. Now we need to make some coffee, so let's use our invisible grinder. Bam. Let's move this on the side for now. Here I will use scale, so let's put coffee pod. Well, this is not a coffee masterclass, but this thing we put on top called uh, V60 coffee maker. Reset scale to zero. Next, I put paper filter inside and wash it with hot water. Now let's add our grinded coffee. This is the way I make coffee for myself and we're gonna have about 11 or 12 ounces here. And total brewing time will take about three and a half to four minutes. Well, I value your time, so let's speed it up here. But while you're waiting, can you please go hit the like button? Thank you so much. Now put our freshly brewed coffee into the mug and also almost to the top. Well, just a little bit more. There you go. I'm gonna stir it a few times with a spoon. Now with help of bar spoon, we're going to slowly pour cream on top of coffee. This is totally optional, but for the garnish, I will use nutmeg. And this is our pro version of Irish coffee. Let me know in the comments which one you like so far, one or two. And now we're going to make our expert version. First, let's preheat our glass with hot water. And now we're going to make small amount of Demerara syrup. It's really easy to make, exactly like simple syrup, except that we use one part of Demerara sugar with hot water. You can boil it, but I need really small amount, so I'm going to stir it until sugar is completely dissolved. Right now, put it on the side. Now we need some grinded coffee, so let's use again our magic grinder. Oh, that's just perfect. For this version, we'll brew our coffee in Chemex. Stick paper filter inside. Let's wash it with hot water. Put it back into Chemex. With this amount, I will be able to make two cups of coffee. Now I'm going to pour hot water on top, but this entire process will take about four, four and a half minutes. So for you, I'm going to speed it up. <laughs> and our fresh coffee is ready, but we're not gonna use it right away, so let's also put it on the side for now. Now I'm going to use creamer to make special whipped cream. Let's pour first two ounces of heavy cream, and we also need half ounce of Bailey's Irish cream. Pour it into cream maker, put one charger, and close it until you hear this really pleasant sound. Ready? You don't have to shake it for too long, few times just enough. Well, your glass is definitely warm now, so you can get rid of that water. Pour half ounce of Demerara syrup, well, you already know my Irish whiskey choice, so let's pour one ounce of proper 12. Now let's pour our freshest coffee, just don't forget to leave a little room. And slowly, just like I'm doing here, pour cream on top of coffee so you'll have a perfect layer. If you guys like any of the versions, please send this video to someone who likes to make and drink Irish coffee. As always, never be afraid to make something new, and I'll see you in the next video.